welcome back to my youtube channel i know it's been forever the last time i tried to do this was al's birthday and it was a fail but this is a special vlog because we're surprising the kids with the last minute disneyland trip well when i say we're surprising i should say my husband and my sister so ever's birthday was last weekend and he wanted to go fishing he didn't go because the office threw a really nice joint birthday party for us so he went this weekend and he left us disneyland tickets hotel an envelope for each of us with cash super thoughtful super sweet my sister helped him with it and the kids have no idea i told him we're going to san diego to pick up his dad's fish that was processed and that i would take l to in Taifun because she loves that place but she has no idea that we're actually going to Disneyland so today's early out I was just at mass puppy red um, I'll insert the little video here the people who have been treated unjustly may have the wish to forgive those who have hurt them let us pray to the Lord super cute um so we're gonna have lunch with my mom because she came into town my brother my sister and the kids and then from there we're gonna head out let's see hopefully they haven't caught on because Elle's super intuitive and metiche so hopefully i can keep my mouth shut and melissa she almost ruined it this weekend i mean this morning she almost ruined it but she didn't hopefully l didn't catch it hopefully they'll be pleasantly surprised because i know i was super surprised and this will be the first time that we actually execute a last minute surprise Disneyland trip. Hey guys, what? I have something to tell you. What? Guess where we're going. What? Where? To Disneyland. Actually? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Daddy surprised us with the trip, the ticket. That'd be so excited. I thought we were going San Diego. No. Did you really? Did you really? You didn't, you didn't know? No. You really didn't know? No. Because Anani's almost said it right now at lunch. Oh, did you think I paid attention to what she says? And Isha almost said it in this the morning. morning. Uh, and then I thought I, you saw the tickets on Isha's phone. Oh no, I thought that was old. She just has some like random like, Are you excited? Shots. Yeah, she has like random screenshots. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you excited, puppy? Yeah. What did we say? Where, where are we going? I don't know. We're going to Disneyland. We're going to Disneyland, bruh. Buffy, we're going to Disneyland. I'm excited. Oh. <laughs> South which, which park? Disneyland. Disneyland. Oh, I haven't been to Disneyland in like two years. I, I want to go to California Adventure. I know. It's my that's favorite. Why, that's why we picked. So we switched off. I had to post something for a social media campaign. So now the sister's driving. I drive for a living. Um, yeah, she comes down a lot and where she lives is like a four hour drive. So we're headed to Costa Mesa to eat at, what's the place called? Folks. Folks? Folks Pizza. It's all over our Instagram, so we're gonna try it. Elle's been on her iPad looking at what she wants to eat and what she wants to do at Disneyland. Bubby's just been on his iPad. Um, but we should be there in an hour and a half. We're gonna have dinner and then we're gonna go check into the hotel and then head to downtown Disney, which is our usual tradition. Sleep in and then head to the park, right? So we'll check in later at the pizza place and show you guys. I don't know if we remember. I know, we, we, we always say we're gonna share them. and we forget, but we're gonna try and see if Instagram's right about this one. Places have you been to that, like Instagram hypes it up? Um, what restaurant? I don't know. We went to one that was just meh, remember? Where? I think it was in Newport. The Little Marine? Mm. Or Mama D's? No, Mama D's is worth the. Um, Mama D's is always good. What's really another good. one? Been good. I haven't been to Mama D's in a while, but that's a classic. Um, I don't remember. You took us to one and it was just meh. Is it, is it the one where I burnt my mouth off? It might have been. The one, the one where you just did that. Like, oh, oh no, I know which one we took ever for breakfast in San Diego. And it was just. And we waited a long ass time and it was just. Okay, but before we went to Legoland. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, uh -huh. I don't remember what that what was called, but that was, was They messed up my potatoes. It was unmemorable, yeah. They messed up all those potatoes. I don't know how you mess up potatoes. And then Sunday, we're gonna try to get into Disney Typhoon because that's Elle's favorite. And maybe go to the and mall. Go, to bre go for breakfast. Yeah, go for breakfast. That's the best way that you can get in, like remember walking. Brea eating there with the chocolate. Oh yeah, so um, yeah, and then we might do a little shopping and then head home. Just a little. Just a little. 
No damage. No damage. We made it. We made it. We, we did forgot it. to show you the restaurant. It was really loud again. in there. It was really loud. We had in a there. banging playlist. But it was it 10 out of 10. Us. 10 out of 10. It was delicious. Really good pizza. Was the pizza good, puppy? Yeah! Can you tell them now that you're excited about Disneyland? Black beer, the last pizza. Hold on, I'm stuffing on my leg. Tell them what your dad did to you guys. What did he give you guys? Oh, Money! Yeah. He gave puppy. What, are they, what did your notes say? Uh, I forgot. It says, I love you, puppy. Buy me something. Find and something. he gave me a soda, too. No, he didn't. <laughs> Just kidding. Let me see fit check. Oh. Rats. This is class of 2000. Puppy, stay here. So now where are we going? Downtown Disney. We didn't bring a stroller. Wish us luck. Puppy, go. I don't know. Puppy, where are we going now? Downtown Disney. Puppy, what were you saying? When mom gets mad at you, what are you going to tell her? No. Say it. No. Go down. Calm down? Better. No. But how? What are you gonna get at downtown Disney? I don't know. You don't know? No. What are you gonna buy me? Uh, I'll say. But I don't have to have. Mom, you know you can't go and get, bring me to Disneyland without a stroller. <laughs> Buffy, you're six. That's true. Buffy, you're a grown ass man. You can walk. Buffy, you're six. You're fine. You're gonna be I'm seven. gonna regret this decision when I rent a stroller tomorrow. When mom gets mad at you, what are you, you gonna say? You, she's gonna rent the stroller. Oh, don't get stuck! Buenos dias, Alegria. Buenos dias. Show the kids. I love that Alice will be miss fishing Buffy while we record. <laughs> well, today is a lovely day in Disney's It seems not so crowded. It's a little overcast, which is nice. Tiana's Palace. Right. They just sorry. They just uh, reopened it. I don't remember what was there before. Does anyone remember? Yeah. Fun fact. This is Al's favorite movie. And her favorite princess, right baby? Yeah. Let's go see the inside of it. It's where they sell the beignets. Oh, what's your favorite Disneyland treat? I don't know. I like the, the beignets. person that came up to your head. Beignets. And what's your least favorite Disneyland treat? Uh, my least favorite. Uh huh. The apple. The apples? The apple, yeah, she doesn't like the apples. So what's your favorite Disneyland treat? Uh, it depends on what I'm in the mood for. What's the, what's the first thing that came to your head though? Um, the Mickey's peanut butter sandwich. And what's your least favorite treat? Um, I don't like those Minute Maid cup, all the frozen. The lemonade. I, I know it's an unpopular opinion, but all the ice cream and the frozen all stuff. Ice cream. I feel like, and then I feel like you can buy those at Albertsons. Mm -hmm. I local, local grocery store. They sell the Mickey Mouse ones there too. Those okay, Mickey Bobby. Frozen lemonades. No. Bobby, what's your favorite Disneyland treat? Popcorn. Yeah. What's your least favorite? Uh, I don't know. I haven't tried that. I think Bobby, popcorn and churros are his favorite. Yeah, that's my, all I think Disneyland. My favorite is a Mickey's peanut butter sandwich and my least favorite is the churros. Also, thank you. Also, everyone's doing line for these infamous chocolate chip cookies. Heard it gets like an hour long. Would you do an hour long, long for an hour line, an hour long line for chocolate chip cookies? No. Yeah. I wouldn't. Oh, I'll look there. Especially with our famous Toll House recipe. Why? Why wait? Why wait? They closed Splash Mountain and now they're making it to Tiana's. It's opening right in that summer. That's exciting. I don't know how I feel though. That's like nostalgia. They're reading my childhood. No, I would never really got on that, right? I'm okay. I've never been on it. And I feel like they I got on it many times and me rosé muchas veces después de la agua. And then I just feel like they need more Tiana stuff because Tiana is Elle's favorite, so I, I love it. I mean, I like it, but it's just... And then it's perfect because it's like New Orleans, this whole area, like it's like... Was Splash Mountain the movie? Yeah. Did you watch it? No. You remember Slash Mountain? Is no. It? They said it was it's just trippy as hell. They said it was based off something bad, that's why it changed. Bad? I don't know. I don't know. No. It was just like out of touch. Is like, that conspiracy? Are there Disney conspiracies? Yeah. 
I'd love to know. I think that's a little racist. I think that's supposed to be a little racist. Or racist, not a little racist. I haven't watched, I just have never seen it. Also, did you guys know you can get on canoes in Disneyland? I like, know. Have you been on? Have you been? I have. I've never ate at this country fair. So we're going to... Thank you. We're going to Star Wars Land for the first time. Can you believe that? We've come to Disneyland many times. No, it's this one. We come to Disneyland many times. We go to California Adventure. Yeah, we haven't been to Star we've never, Wars. Well, we've walked through, but... You guys are like, mira, hay una pichu pared, todo eso es fácil, me tienen que pasar aquí en la esquina. I said we never... Oh my goodness. I said we never... We've never okay, walked. Nunca. We just walked through because we always felt like posers because we've never seen any Star Wars movies. Not a single Star Wars movie have I seen. Not a single Lord of the Rings. Not a single... And then it was just so new Sorry. and trendy that we didn't want to take up space for people to actually like enjoy it. But I feel like it's been open long enough so now we can take up space. Will we want to watch a movie after this? No. I but who knows? Maybe. I'm just never trying to go never. to... I'm just trying to go to Olga's Cantina. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be more honest. I'm just trying to go to Olga's Cantina. La borracha. It's 11 or 12. It's 5 o'clock somewhere. Brunch. I have a reservation, a reservation at Olga's Cantina. Is it Olga's or Olga's? Olga's. Who's Olga? I don't know. Our <laughs> lack of Star Wars. Why does he have a cantina? Our, our lack of Star Wars knowledge is showing. I felt like a, I like a, such a poser over here <laughs> making it. I don't know. I don't know any story. So we made a reservation at Oga's Cantina. Look at our Oga's. Who, is who they are. We're gonna look up to. Our, who's Oga? Our Guinness. I never watched a Star Wars movie. Who's Oga? Same. Oh, he's scary. Can you see it? He's scary. I thought it was this. I thought guy. it was a girl. <laughs>
We didn't vlog the last half of our trip because we met up with some of our friends from SoCal. It was nice, but we're done, right? We turned in our stroller. Hope you guys too but if yeah. we're gonna walk back to our hotel and call it a night so we can get up early and have some brunch, go to South Coast Plaza, do some shopping. So we'll see you guys in the morning. Buenos dias, alegría. Is this considered day two or day three? Three, I guess. Sunday. It Sunday. is Sunday. Um, we are headed to South Coast Plaza to have breakfast of champs at Elle's favorite <laughs> spot called Taifung. Um, but we wanted to give a little recap on yesterday what was peaks and pits of the park, starting with Elle. Peaks. Probably because we got like doing a bunch of new things because we were a bunch of stuff we haven't gone on before. Uh huh. And just like being on that side in general. We always go to California Adventure. And what was your pit? Uh, the kids in the room next to us and above us. Oh yeah. <laughs> At our hotel we had the world's greatest neighbors. Let's just put it there. That, they were like our alarm clock. Honestly, like Papi got up so early yesterday that they went to Disneyland because they were just so... It felt like they were in our room. Like we're sharing a room with them. <laughs> Papi, what was your favorite part of the trip? Your new friend? Noah. Koa. 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 And what was your least favorite part of the trip? Losing your voice. <laughs> she says she know. Losing to me at Buzz Lightyear? Did you lose to Melissa at Buzz Lightyear? Yeah, it was 8,000 to 28,000. It's okay. I gave him no mercy. You'll get him next time. My favorite part of the trip was... Riding that new Toontown that ride. That was cute. It was like really cute. Part. Even the wait was cute. Uh -huh. Like the whole setup and the deco. But that uh -huh. was cute. And then my least favorite part was losing this little turd for a couple minutes. I'll tell the story. So we were, his favorite part was meeting this new friend Koa. I guess that was my least favorite part because of cabron. So the mom and the son went to go get a spoon or something while we were waiting, sitting um, on Main Street waiting for the parade. And Papi was waiting with me, or so I thought. Like, he decided to go with them, but like mid, she was already like halfway to the parlor or whatever to get her spoon. Y que me doy cuenta que el papi's gone. And I said, my heart drops, and you can imagine, but luckily he went with them. But you're never gonna do that to me again, right, Papi? And then when he found him, he said he didn't care. Yeah, he gave me a little sass, but I, I was on the. He said sorry, and we, I forgave him. He's not gonna do that again, right? When that happened, they were waiting for the parade, and me and my mom were on, waiting in line to go up the Mountain. Yeah, that was fun. That was fun. What was your peak in your pit, Linda? Uh, my peak was trying things we haven't like done before. Like we never venture out to Star Wars, and that was fun. And then seeing my SoCal friends. So Vivian and Sally, like I met them, the Al was tiny, like I don't think she was even, maybe two. And we used to come out here and they followed me on Instagram and we just met up at Stan. So every time I come, we almost, I almost always see one or the other, but this time I got to see both. So that was probably my peak. And my pit was definitely our room situation. We were so loud. It literally felt like we were sharing a room with them. I could hear every kind. And then one of the little kids, like, we had those joint rooms, but obviously we weren't joint. He kept trying to open, like, our room. We should have just let him in. Maybe he would have been quieter. Maybe. <laughs> but overall, it was a really good trip. I had a really nice time. Same. Really nice quality time with my family. I got to see old friends. Like, it was nice. What was the favorite thing you ate? My favorite thing I ate, I'll start since I went last. Um, honestly, I didn't eat anything delicious yesterday. No. But probably the cookies. Oh no, you know that garlic pretzel bread at Oga's or Ogie's or oh, whatever? Oh, Castina, that, that was bomb. Oh, what was your favorite thing? Uh, at the very end, uh, the very last thing that we did, we got we went to like the professional corner, I think. Mm -hmm. And they had like a bread bowl full of mac and cheese. Oh, that was and good. That and was cheesy. good. They put like a bunch of cheese on top. It was actually good. Yes. And sourdough. Papi, what was your favorite thing that you ate? Mm, I don't know. Your churro, yeah. your popcorn. Yeah, popcorn. 
popcorn que ahora sale mi niña. Yeah. Um, my favorite thing that I ate, I don't think we ate a whole lot. No nos, no nos atascamos this time like we normally it's do. There's, honestly, I think there's way less food on I thought it was funny that Linda outside. paid. How much money did you pay for a pinguino marinela? You're gonna take this exit, Linda, sorry. Uh, por andar distraída. Por andar Girl. Um, my favorite, you're good. My favorite thing, oh yeah, Linda paid, I don't know how much for one liter, I don't think we know Marinela will add the photo here. It was cute, it but was I was cute. just like, no. And it had a penguin on it just to make it more. Uh, pinguino. It was I. It was I. Um, my favorite like thing, it. I like the Mickey's peanut butter sandwich, but that's a treat, I don't know. Um, you didn't eat that at Disneyland, you ate that at California, you're not California, you ate that downtown. at downtown. Disney. Um, Honestly, my favorite thing was the pizza we ate at Folks Pizzeria that we didn't record. Oh, like yeah, that, that place is ten pizza. out of ten. Papi ate more pizza than me. That's the most I've ever seen Papi eat. You really like the pizza, huh, Papi? Am I going straight? Yes, continue straight. Not the exit. And straight. then he ate, he ate two in the hotel room. Oh yeah, then he had. Home. We took the leftovers. And Damn, I Papi. No, I won't well, say the last word. I don't think he did. I think he's just being shy boy. Yeah. I can barely hear him. No, mommy, it's because I play with Spider-Man. Oh, I love him. Oh, okay. <laughs> no. I'm sick. I'm sick. We don't have a reservation and we're just hoping for the best. We thought they opened at 10.30, but apparently they opened at 9.30, so we'll we're be all right. booking it. Um, so if you guys ever go there, you need a reservation way in advance. We usually have one, but or if you're gonna walk in, get there really early or really late. I remember once it was like nine. We went, we got there at like eight, and they told us that the only like reservation they had was at twelve. No, it was eleven thirty p.m. Yes, at La Jolla, and they're like, you have to order immediately. When, like once you sit down, you need to know what you want. But we couldn't wait. We were like starving, and it was already late. We went to True Foods. Yeah, we ended up eating at True Foods. True Foods is good too. I mean, nothing like Den Tai Fung, but yeah, it's good. good. We're gonna get Tacos Locos on the way home. What are Tacos Locos? The Dorito shell ones. Oh, no thank you. I don't like those. I like the soft tacos with the salsa. I don't like it, but like on Nando Cruda. Are you still recording me? I don't know if I've On the way back from Vegas, that's what she did. No, on the way back from Phoenix from concerts, we always stop. And that's My the only time I ever like ate. 20 Doritos he eats tacos. like 20 Doritos Locos Taco. That's the only time What do you like better, them. Del Taco or Taco Bell? I think. Or McDonald's. Del Taco. No. Between Del Taco no, and Taco Bell. No, she gets McDonald's on like oh. my back. From Vegas, yeah, we get McDonald's. What's your favorite fast food, though? Probably Chick fil A. Papi, what's your favorite fast food? Maybe, maybe Freddy's. Freddy's? Freddy's <laughs> is a banger. Yeah, it's good, but I'm going to listen to Freddy's. I've listened to Freddy's twice. <laughs> I'm listening to Freddy's. What's your favorite fast food? Probably In N Out. Uh -huh. My favorite fast food, probably In N Out too. It just, I mean, it, like they're all for different occasions. I don't, we don't eat a whole lot of fast no. food though. We're heading home. We left the mall, but horrible vloggers that we are, we forgot to record anything. But we ended up getting right into Din Tai Fung, which was great. So they open at 9.30, not 10.30, like they stay online. Um, we had all our favorites. I'll, I took pictures, so I'll insert them around. Um, that's Elle's like, favorite restaurant. What's your favorite thing from there? I like the fried rice and the soup dumplings. I like everything. She likes everything, but the shrimp fried rice and the soup dumplings are her favorite. What's your favorite? The the vegan um, wontons with the sauce. Oh yeah, those are bomb. Even if you're not vegan, like they're really good. The sauce is what makes it. Tell them, tell them the story about last time you ordered Because it. I ordered it incorrectly. I ordered the dumplings instead of the wontons. And the difference is the wontons come in um, the with the sauce. sauce and the dumplings come dry. So I ordered the vegan dumplings and so they came with not, with no sauce. And honestly, they're not good on its own. They're good with the sauce. The, the sauce, sauce, sauce is bomb. And so I told the waitress, hey, can we have a side of sauce? And she's like, yeah, but it's going to cost you like $10. And my husband said that was fine. And the waitress made such a big deal out of it, like, ooh, girl, they're tweeting you. <laughs> and we just You're laughed about it. Yeah, like, fuck you, well, I can't say you that, bet. but it's like, F you money. Um, but it was really funny. 
We didn't even check the sauce tip out. Was that the that same one? Huh? At Costa Mesa? Same, this one. And then after that, we took Elle to Pop Mart, her favorite little figurine. Puppy shop Hot and then Puppy Hot Seas chocolate because he's obsessed with just the plain ass milk chocolate bar. This and the, what was his quote? What was his oh, because I go, do you want to get? He grabbed it. I was like, do you want to get um, one? I was go, do you want to get two? He's like, of course, because two is better than one or something like that. What did that. you say, Puppy? What did you say when we got the second chocolate bar? It's better than one, two. <laughs> there you go. So Fact. sale vara. And then no, no, así pasó so con las viejas. And then Melissa was gonna look at some Dior glasses, and I was we supposed looked, to. We did look at some Dior. Glasses. And I was supposed to look at some uh, Saint Laurent sling bags, and they had them. They just didn't have them in my size. Um, and, and then we had the glasses, and they didn't like that on me. And then she didn't like the Dior's on, so then we ended up in the men's Louis Vuitton. Um, and she bought the glasses she's currently wearing. She wanted all black. What do you guys think? She was there for like 30 minutes between two pairs. And then I got some new millionaires. We should really get, I. you know what? Like I don't even think I could vlog inside a store because I would feel like so awkward. But I see people's vlogs like them of them shopping inside like luxury stores and I'm just like, I don't know, I feel weird. And I feel like you're not allowed to record. I don't know, but I ended So millionaires are like my favorite shape of sunglasses. Like I collect them, I love them. And then we went in and I saw these checkered brown and like tan ones I've never seen before. I guess they're the Pharrell um, collab. They're these, but I got these. I really like them. And Melissa got those. And then we grabbed uh, tea and coffee pump gas and now we're heading home um, the guy should be home from fishing from Cabo around the same time so yeah we had, we had a good trip it was really nice we got our sister time in um, it has been a minute it has vlogging I miss vlogging I think we I need to start doing YouTube again I keep telling her or a podcast because we don't live in the same city so I mean I don't think we did a great job of vlogging. Like this vlog is gonna be missing a lot of sections, but at least we're we're, 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 we're we're rookies again. We're getting back into it. So hopefully we'll have these more consistently, more spill the teas. But thank you guys for watching, and we'll see you next video. Say bye, kids. Say bye, guys. Bye. Say bye. Puppy. Bye. Say bye, Isha.